Cynthia Bailey, spill the tea. What's the best sex tip Candy Burris has ever given to you? I know that you're in a new relationship and audiences are gonna meet the Mike Hill. Yes. Tell everybody how you met Mike Hill. I met Mike Hill through my friend, Steve Harvey. Like I went on Steve's show, actually talking about housewives. And then he was like, get an update on my dating life. And I was living my best life and I was dating. I was like, I don't want to be exclusive. I just got divorced. I just want to be like a player. I'm 50 cent. You already be like, out in these streets. I was in these streets, honey. So Steve Harvey brings you on his show. He brings me on his show. And how many guys are in the lineup? There's three out front and there's like three backups that I could trade out. Mm -hmm. But I didn't actually even use my trade outs. Cause I, I, I saw the one that I wanted as soon as I walked out there and it was Mike. <laughs> When we first met, you know, he was dating. He was like, you know, still fighting in LA, mm -hmm. doing his thing. And I was still over here doing my thing. But we started going on dates and it wasn't super consistent at first, but you know, he would always call and check on me or send me a text. And I was like, this guy's really like something about him. He just never gave up on me. And I wasn't giving him a lot, a lot of energy in the beginning. I really honestly yeah. wasn't. Cause I, did, I didn't want, I was a, a little afraid of him. I was like, ah, I don't want to sit down. He, I don't want to settle down yet. And he seemed like a serious guy. This is what I love about Mike the most. And I do love him. I can say that very freely. Hey, hey, no. by the way, Mike Hill is in this audience right now. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, babe. The great thing about Mike is I don't feel like I have to play games, because I won't, not at this point in my life, I'm not. You know, he knows what he wants, he's very comfortable with who he is, and you know, I don't, you know, my girlfriend's like, oh my God, you already take your wig off in front of him? I'm like, yes, he can help me take my wig off at this point. Hold on, hold on, hold I on, do, hold I on. I do, I take it off in front of him. You right. take your wig off in front of Mike? Absolutely. Every How day. long did it take you to take your wig off in front of Mike? And uh, be honest. It was soon, babe, what, like, Second date, I was like, shit, I gotta take this wig off. We can do all this. That's love because you know what? Women don't take their wig off in front of anybody. Oh, I take the wig off, the makeup off, the lashes off, everything. Everything. I strip down, baby. I strip all the way down. It's just who I am. I'm not this. I'm not wig, a wig and lashes every day. I'm really not. And it was important for me to make sure that he could love all of me. You know, my fear was I would meet a guy who was a great guy who just wouldn't want to be on TV. You know, the great thing, the blessing is, Mike is already on TV. He's a sportscaster. He worked for ESPN for years, and now he's at Fox Sports. Mike yeah. works here. He lives here. Yeah. He has a beautiful home here. Yeah. Just yeah. built. You're about to move in the whole nine yards. Yep. I'm going to give you all the tea. If Big Papa let you put the peach down and pick up the diamond and move to Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, would you be down? And is that something you're going to try to fight for? The door is open. The door is open. The door is open. Who said that? <laughs> I need you to leave my audience with something that they will never forget. And I thought about a question, and Mike Hill, you have three seconds to cover your ears for this one. Cynthia Bailey, spill the tea. What's the best sex tip Candy Burris has ever given to you? Oh, that's actually easy. I tried this on Mike the other day. Mike, uh. cover your ears. <laughs> It's a girl's kiki right now. She told me, and it, and it works. Hold on. <laughs> Let me get a you fresh piece of paper. Hold on, girl. When the guy is getting ready to mm -hmm. like do your kegel thing, like 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 squeeze, like like make your muscles like uh -huh. the, kegel the kegels, thing. Yeah. like right when they get ready to, and I can tell, I can tell. Because of the breathing. Yes. Yeah, when he's getting ready to go. Okay. So when he does that, I start doing that, and it's like, let's just say he ain't going nowhere. <laughs> Bitch! Cynthia ain't worried about nothing. I ain't worried about nothing. Cynthia ain't worried about nothing. Hey, she ain't worried about nothing. Cynthia ain't worried about nothing. Hey, cheers to that. And I'm done. And I'm done, honey. It, that was a sip. <laughs>